Welcome back to New Day, everybody. Pop superstars Lady Gaga and Madonna are in trouble with Russia. The official charge, work visa violations. But is it just a coincidence that both performers are strong supporters of gay rights, which are under serious threat in Russia? Could the charges be payback for their onstage comments during concerts there recently? CNN's Matthew Chance is live in Moscow with the latest. Good morning, Matthew. Good morning, Chris. So Russian officials say they could actually prosecute Lady Gaga and Madonna after discovering they entered the country last year with the wrong paperwork and played concerts here. The problem only came to light after a complaint was made by a leading anti-gay Russian lawmaker, raising suspicions that the whole thing is about punishing the stars for their gay rights stance. Even if you're one of the world's biggest superstars, speaking out on gay rights in Russia is risky, as Lady Gaga is finding out. Tonight, this is my house, Russia. You can be gay in my house. Now, Russian officials say the pop star staged her concert without proper work visas. It's not officially linked to her remarks, but the complaint was filed by Vitaly Milinov, the lawmaker behind Russia's controversial anti-gay laws. Another icon, Madonna, is also accused of spreading what Russia calls gay propaganda after she spoke out at her concert in St. Petersburg last year. But in Russia, activists say gay rights are under increasing pressure, along with anyone who dares to support them. Well, if they're prosecuted, they could face steep fines, even a ban on entering Russia in the future. But critics say the big problem is it could deter American artists from playing concert concerts in Russia in the future, Chris. All right, Matthew, appreciate the reporting this morning. We're